good morning guys hello welcome back to my channel this is Ranger Rangers so today my uh, job uh, I'm gonna do this uh, kitchen part uh, area this side so this is workshop and this is a uh, unit well, this is the old uh, workshop and unit and this is the old uh, cooker as well cooker uh, hub this is a gas and this one I already removed this this is a uh, uh, cooker uh, electric oh no no this is a cooker gas and I removed this and this one I will remove everything here and this side and this one I'm gonna remove this as well because uh, I'm gonna put this uh, freezer this freezer it's gonna put in here alright and I think it's all uh, wool unit okay and base is a base unit alright that's a cooker that I've been removed from that uh, unit Okay, so this is it. I continue this later or next time when I done this as well. Okay, so because he wants to uh, use the kitchen uh, sink, so that's what I install. All right, and that's it. I'm gonna dismantle it now. This is a cooker hood. This one okay so when it's uh, done i will show you as well later or uh, it's depends on uh, how job that i how work that i can finish today okay
Oh, hello guys, uh, this is only I can do this time uh, because uh, this uh, uh, the uh, connection. What I mean in the uh, in here in the uh, circuit breaker because uh, I disconnected this uh, connection from the circuit breaker going to the cooker because uh, last time for their safety. Uh, because last time I cannot finish the uh, kitchen because uh, I working in the uh, toilet upstairs, the bathroom, the toilet. So that's why I uh, disconnect this. Uh, I did not uh, connect the cooker. So right now it's still not uh, connected. So this time I just leave for now because I'm gonna put the work up in here. That's why I cover. I put the uh, conduit. Uh, plastic or insulation uh, uh, cover because uh, there's a cooker here when uh, the cooking so the heat over the, the resistance the heat resistance of this uh, wire uh, it will be uh, resist for uh, heat from the uh, cooker at the back of the cooker so this one, this connection is going to and going co is going to connect in here in this box and the uh, junction box of the cooker. And the cooker as well here, uh, metal one. And this one as well, cover it a metal. Okay, so because I'm gonna put the work top in here, I cannot put the uh, cooker yet. I cannot. I don't connect the cooker yet because uh, it's very hard, you know, to move. So, or or anyway, I, or I connect this one, this uh, cable to the uh, socket, the uh, plug socket in here. Okay, uh, and then I put the thirteen fuse. Anyway, there's already a thirteen fuse arms in here. The fuse, the fuse box. And I'm gonna put a plug 13 fuse as well. Uh, 13 amp fuse and then connect here. And the cooker, the uh, hub, uh, it's need to be connected in here because it's a big load. So that's why I'm gonna put in here. All right. We have a look anyway. Uh, I'm gonna check in the uh, how many uh, wattage of this uh, cooker. If it's uh, capable to use the uh, plug and then I plug on here on the socket or I'm gonna connect also in the uh, uh, 10 mm uh, wire uh, that I already connected here in the box let's have a look uh, let's find out uh, I'm gonna total here I'm gonna total everything if it's uh, safe to connect uh, by using only a plug okay I will have a look in that with that let's see okay so I'm gonna put the work up here so that's why I, I just leave for now because I'm gonna do this now this is a screen for here it's like a standing uh, tree I don't know what I'm gonna put maybe some of the uh, cooking uh, stuff or ingredients uh, uh, like uh, everything that I need uh, for cooking, maybe uh, that's the uh, uh, purpose of this. It's like, like a screen or any fruits or any uh, things things that he can she can put in here on this tree. Okay, uh, I'm gonna symbol this now and look. Let's have a look uh, what we can see after. Okay. one is included as well this frame it's a frame bar it's included as well to the uh, box uh, I took this from the box of the tree
this is also a part of the uh, tray that uh, going to assemble God, my god my god it's lot of it's it's uh lots of parts oh my god it takes time to put it this <sighs> life anyway guys oh my goodness that's right Swanger. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Takes time to assemble this. Patience is a bird too. <laughs> so guys, uh, I didn't uh, expect that uh, it was included to my job or this this uh, unit. If you notice this, uh, it's included. So that's why I wonder where I can get this unit because uh, I cannot find uh, where, which box uh, somewhere uh, in her uh, dining room because uh, all the boxes I put in there so I don't notice that uh, this one this box is a long box a wide one uh, it, is uh, included to my uh, work and to assemble that uh, tree it's terrible oh. big job anyway this is not a joke this is a very very uh, hard job uh, this is one of my uh, encounter uh, I have encountered uh, work uh, in a previous uh, job. This is one of the uh, hardest as well. I can't believe this. I want to surrender. <laughs> I want to surrender this kind of job. But uh, how many times really uh, I try to attempt to surrender this job? But uh, because this uh, this is Ranger Rangers. Just not impossible. Um, rain or shine. This uh, they call that um, not for the weak and faint-hearted. It's alright if uh, only electrical and plumbing. It's alright, but the thing is, this one is a uh, joinery job. So this is latest. This is latest model. This is uh, high tech. Uh, from the past that I already uh, worked or my previous job mm. because normally my job is electrical and plumbing right now since uh, I already stopped to my job as a sub-employed before uh, I worked before a general builder but the thing is uh, because of too much demand uh, or so many demand uh, so I cannot cope up really uh, for all my clients and customers so that's why I focus in electrical only and plumbing and I think it's about uh, 8 years that I already stopped uh, to do a full uh, bathroom and kitchen renovation so but now because I'm coming back and just came back for this kind of job so that's why uh, I'm just new but Anyway, this is not, uh, for me. It's there's no impossible. 
but the thing is very very hard really very very hard this kind of job anyway this is for um, specialized person a specialized builder this kind of job this is a commercial or this is a, a really a new uh, um, technology for uh, house uh, like kitchen and bathroom renovation uh, this is my first time to encounter most of this but it's almost uh, um, solved this uh, kind of uh, problem especially bathroom but uh, anyway the bathroom guys is almost done it's almost done uh, the only thing uh, I did not uh, put there just only strip on the floor that's it uh, strip on the floor in the uh, between the carpet and the uh, laminated floor uh, at the bottom of the uh, door but the rest uh, I try to manage and I can manage myself it's done everything I mean that that is my first time to encounter that kind of job anyway guys to be honest it's very very hard mm, but uh, because I'm doing in YouTube I tried to show and for me everything is uh, or like go with the flow uh, everything will be solved uh, as long as you use your common sense tactics idea experience and the most important thing is common sense yeah uh, for your job to be safety all right okay uh, see you later and i think i'm gonna put this one instead instead of this one instead of that one in the box i'm gonna use this one this uh parts the accessories here and yeah that this one then that one so that one All right and the other one is there this one okay let's find out hello guys that's the uh, capacity of uh, of this cooker it's 3200 watts so 3200 watts divide to 240 it's about or more than 13 amps so let's say 13 amps so so 13 amps uh, our fuse in here is 13 amps so because uh, it's more than 13 amps in in my total so it's better this uh, uh, wire cable for this cooker uh, it would be safer to connect in here in this cooker instead this junction box of the cooker instead of this so just leave for this uh, for the future for any uh, cooker that uh, less than 13 amps uh, load let's say just only like igniter uh, that's fine let's say he has a already has a gas cooker uh, so let's say they need igniter so this is useful for ignition to ignite uh, the uh, cooker to make it fire so because the igniter just only small uh, uh, watts so it is okay safe to use this so this cooker box this kind of box it's connected on this 
switch okay so that's the uh, 10 mil and this is a 50 uh, amperes so it's uh, safer to use even uh, two connection of this uh, switch for coca so this switch uh, going to the circuit breaker this cable going to the circuit breaker it's uh, 50 amps so by uh, 10 mil of our cable so it would be enough to load the uh, cooker hub and this cooker as well all right so much safer so that's what i plan okay guys